What's going on folks? So I thought we would do another geological orientated video, kind of like when we flew the drone over the Hoy Hill. But um, instead of flying over a hill, I wanted to fly over a glaciated valley um, or a valley that has been shaped by the recession of a glacier. Um, and this is really neat because uh, on Mars, there is a valley that I think is overlooked a lot. Um, it's just north of the Valles Mineras, which a lot of people know is a massive canyon on Mars, just to the east of um, Olympus Mons, which is the largest volcano in the universe, um, and some of the other smaller surrounding volcanoes. Um, but just to the north of Valles Mineras is another large valley area with sort of a catastrophic floodplain known as the Kasai Valles. A Kasai actually means Mars in Japanese, um, but the Kasai Valles is this massive floodplain um, that was either caused by the recession of the glaciers um, or a catastrophic flood. To the north of Coquitlam, there is a large aggregate mining area where they pull a lot of the glacial till out of our valley. Um, and so this is really neat because what we can do is we can actually fly near some of the areas with the drone and get uh, a good representation of what the whole area looks like underneath the ground. But in order to do this, I'm gonna need something that flies. Now we're on the road. Well, we are at the model airport. Just over to the left, you can see Coquilla Mountain, and then the watershed is further down Pipeline Road at the very end. Directly across from us is uh, the uh, Coquitlam River, and the runway is just on this section right across here. But as you're watching, I just wanted to talk briefly a little bit about till. Till is really cool because till is just the sand looking stuff on the side of the mountain. Um, it's from the Ice Age, so it's what we call Ice Age sediment. Um, and it's uh, an Ice Age glacial till. That's really neat because sometimes Ice Age glacial till can contain placer deposits. And placer deposits sometimes contain valuable minerals like gold inside of them. And so uh, for a really, really long time, it was that till that people were panning along really well-known rivers like the Fraser River, looking for gold in the gold rush during the 1800s. With that being said, I don't think there's much gold underneath the mountain here. I definitely think that that till that's being mined currently is uh, being used for a lot of other valuable things like concrete and, uh, you know, just everyday building materials. 